Hey everybody, my name's Sonic. I'm about to watch a Nintendo Direct that just started just now. Here we go. Let's do this. Ah. Oh yeah, let's see it. Nintendo Direct. Yep, that's where it all snapped. We got a bunch of super fast road stuff in this one. What is this? February 17th, 2021, Nintendo Direct. Pirate just disappeared. That's what this is. Oh. Just started, Nintendo Direct. It's kind of live, actually. It is live. Mm-hmm. This game. I forgot what it's called though. I couldn't find it anyway. Well, it looks familiar. You know? I forgot what game this is. It's a guy that's it's on the switch! Of the face of all rest. Without a trace. Where have you gone? I'll find you. Whatever it takes. Yeah, reaction to the reaction to the track just started. Live. Yeah, reaction to it. This is where you were. Mm -hmm. Lyra! Sorry, Rex. Uh -oh. What happened? I couldn't tell you. Because I got an invitation to join Smash. Huh? What? Okay. Ah. Smash. Just sit back and leave it to me, this was Smash Brothers. Behold the power of the Aegis. I couldn't tell what this was. Wow, okay. <laughs> Funny. What the heck? Nah. Funny. Oh my god. That's genius. You're pretty much owning them. And these are seasoned fighters. <laughs> there are no pushovers. Okay. Wow. Everything. Talk about a tight spot. Mithra? Let me handle this. Oh? Who? Who? The? Ah! Mithra! Cutting it close, huh? Oh, hey, were these guys planning on running? Gee, I feel kind of bad now. Ah, uh, no, I had no idea what this was, honestly. Ah! Punishment. When it started up, I didn't know it was Smash. I was like, whoa, whoa, it's Smash Bros. Ah. Huh. That character wanted to be in Smash Bros. to get in. You two can swap between each other. Freely. Serious fight. Speed. Hmm? Together. Nothing can stand our way. Quite the spectacle. Oh, a confused there. Two yeah. characters in one. Oh, I missed this buddy. Oh, oh lots of love. Oh, look, our friends are here. And <laughs> well. there's some more. Okay. Oh, that's all from healthy. Uh oh. Still in the game. Huh? Ah! Sure did. Our power. Ah. Do not play on the like, still in the final smash. Ah. So they put more. Okay. Yeah, I thought. During smash, I won't go easy on you. Fighting words. No. I thought this was a Xeno Blade. That was in. Well. Yeah, it's another Xeno Blade character. Of course. I couldn't tell what game that was that the character's from. Xeno Blade Chronicles 2 is in Smash Brothers. With those characters. I, I was like confused there. What? Okay. Hello, everyone. It's been a while. Yes, it has. I'm Shinya Takahashi from Nintendo. Hello. So. 
Last year, we delivered some news through a series of Nintendo Direct mini presentations. All right. However, we haven't been able to present a Nintendo Direct in this style for some time. Oh, yeah. True, man. I understand. I'm happy to share this Nintendo Direct with you all today. Ooh. All right. All right, let's see it. Hopefully, we appreciate your continued us. support. Well, thank you for showing. Okay. Huh. What you just saw yeah. was the reveal trailer for the newest fighter in the Super Smash Bros. Ultimate game, mm -hmm. Pyro yep. and Mithra. They originally appeared in the Xenoblade Chronicles series as Rex's two-in-one ally. Please look forward to seeing their moveset in Super Smash Bros. Ally. Ultimate. This fighter releases yeah. in March, so we hope <laughs> you'll stay tuned just a bit longer. Next one. All right, wow. let's continue right, with our first batch of yeah, Nintendo was... Switch headlines. So that was Smash Bros. I wasn't sure what that was. Or she was Smash Brothers. Oh, now they're on the Switch. Okay, great. Oh, guys. I have yet to kind of play this myself. I don't know. Just to like. Really? No. Nah. I don't know. Yeah. This game. Why is it reminding me of Mario Party for some odd reason? Zoom done. I don't know why. Fall guys, Ultimate Knockout comes to the Nintendo Switch system summer 2021. That's a silly game. It reminds me of Mario Party for some reason. 22 minutes before the solar system is destroyed. Ooh? Venture into the vast reaches of space to uncover the secrets left behind by an ancient civilization. You have 22 minutes. After that, the sun will explode and the solar system will be annihilated. Ooh. However, everything will reset, allowing you to continue exploring while retaining information you gathered. Hmm. Right. Mm -hmm. By repeating these cycles, you'll gradually unravel the mysteries hidden in the universe. Well, what messages okay. will you discover? How can you prevent the sun from exploding? Okay. Why is the solar system trapped in an endless time loop? Time loop. Find out when the critically acclaimed Outer Wilds launches on Nintendo Switch Summer 2021. Yeah, that's game's already been mentioned, hasn't Put your it? Put sleuthing skills to the test in two wow, classic right murder there. mystery games. Hmm. Famicom Detective Club, The Missing Heir, and Famicom Detective Club, The Girl Who Stands Behind, two deep cuts from Nintendo history, are coming to North America for the first time. What? Localized in English and modernized for the Nintendo oh. Switch system. Suspense, drama, and twists and turns await at every corner. You'll be on the edge of your seat as you dive Not into the deep narrative set in Japan. In one game, you'll solve a complex murder Synthesis. case surrounding a wealthy family in a haunted village while it's dealing like a novel with the Visual novel? But that's, that's not the only case to crack. I don't know if this is a visual novel or not. Mostly talking. Mm. In the other game, you'll investigate a supernatural rumor after a mysterious death to free students from a sinister nightmare interrogate suspects and hunt for clues to piece together these chilling conundrums can you figure out who the culprit is before it's too late oh, okay that's kind of the deadly truth in famicom detective club the yeah. missing air and Famicom Detective Club, The Girl Who Stands Famicom. Behind, coming to Nintendo Switch May 14th. You know what they used to today on Nintendo eShop. Ooh, okay. Famicom, that's a Nintendo console the in Japan. Begins. The Famicom. Right, Super Famicom, I forgot what it's called. If it's not Super Famicom. Yeah, isn't that the Nintendo console in Japan? It's they called the Nintendo Entertainment System. They call it the Famicom. What is this? Okay. Why does it still feel like it's Smash Bros again? It feels like it's still Smash Brothers. 
is this? Oh. Samurai. Warriors 5. No, the way they did that is like, oh, it's not Smash Bros. It's Japanese the text. latest entry in the Samurai Warriors franchise is coming to Nintendo Switch. I don't know why I thought that. Dive into the history Weird. of the Sengoku period as the series now shines the spotlight oh. on Nobunaga Oda and Mitsuhide Akechi. Uh. Character designs and visuals have been revamped for this installment. Oh. Unleash high octane moves in electrifying 1 versus 1000 battles. Is that the same? In Samurai Warriors 5. Slashing its way onto Nintendo Switch, summer 2021. Is that like another thing like Hyrule Warriors, for example? You know what I'm talking about? That's the what it looks like. Of Fadiel beckons. Same people who made Hyrule Warriors After made that, or not years, mistaken. Legend of Mana looks like featuring it. Featuring remastered HD graphics is coming to Nintendo Switch. For us? Nah. You'll Gotta set off on a journey to find the now. mystical mana tree seen in a dream. Before discovering the world map, is empty. During your travels, you'll acquire special items called artifacts. Place them on the map to bring towns, dungeons, and other lands to life. It's up to you uh -huh. on when and where to place artifacts, as well All as right. how to advance the story. Uh -huh. Join forces with characters, each on their own personal Thank quest. You, sir, sir. We will Square off oh. against fearsome monsters. Ah. Or take a break from adventure and rest up at home. The music has been rearranged for this enhanced version, and you can alternate between the new arrangement and the original soundtrack. Other features have been added, including the ability to turn off enemy encounters, as well as the new minigame hmm. Ring Ring Land. Well, the Legend of Mana will launch on Game Nintendo Boy, Switch please. June 24th. Hmm. All right. Okay. Thursday Show Smash was the first thing of the drag. Monster Hunter. Ah! Oh, is that the new Monster Hunter game? Finally coming out. Soon. Giant Steiner. I'll admit, yeah, still I've never played a Monster Hunter game before. Ah! Got hit. I'm serious. Ah! We'll be done. Ow. Yeah, it's that newest one. If they release a demo sometime along the a demo for it, they release a demo. Ow. Okay. Uh. Oh. Oh. I have right. important news. So it's finally beginning. Go assemble the villagers. Mm -hmm. Fifty years ago, Kamuro mm. Village was attacked by the Rampage and Magnum Malo. And we suffered some devastating casualties. How can we mm. fight against that? Our hunter's oh. about to face oh. the biggest oh. challenge yet. Oh, oh. 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 No. oh the big guy. We can't big lose this gate. Oh. Pull yourself together. You're not getting in. Okay. Let's go, everyone! Three. Go rampage somewhere Ooh. else! You listen to me now! Oh. What? In controller? I do all of them able to do that. Watch out for the apex! Do not let it pass! Have an apex? It's, it's not an apex legend. It's just an apex. Do I do there? Eh? Not an apex legend. Just an apex. Uh, that's the hundred rise. I don't know, that's what it looked like it was saying there. We start preparations right Funny. away. We're here to offer assistance. Mm, no, we no. must stop the calamity. Okay. Romantic. Good thing Lars Toy Six 2021. Yep, yeah, that's the launch on the rise. That's that game I seen Nintendo direct over. Oh no, you never know I like it this this likely the first Monster Hunter that Direct. That was the latest trailer Monster Hunter, for Monster Hunter Rise from Capcom. Mm-hmm. You never know. How will our I'm heroes not... fare against these ferocious monsters? I haven't played any Stay Monster Hunter game. Stay the latest installment in the Monster Hunter series, Man. launching March 26th. Mm-hmm. Next month. Next, please take a look at this. All right.
Whoop! More. The is open once again. More Mario Golf? Tee oh my from the God. latest installment of the Mario Golf series, coming to Nintendo Switch. Super Rush. Study the wind and terrain. Take your well. time to think things through. Okay. Then swing. What a ball go. Go full. Enjoy golfing with familiar Mushroom Kingdom characters uh, on courses filled with lush sure. natural scenery. Of course. We go for the chin toss and the sand the trail. Greens, like right? a shot gauge to see how your shot will huh. curve due to slopes. And a scan that lets you examine a this course's is a terrain. Trail. These features can help you ace your shots. Mm, okay. In I play addition some to button controls, you can also use motion pass. controls. By holding a Joy-Con controller oh, like a golf club. That's nice. I like Gently that. Gently swing the controller to have your character swing in the game, letting right. you easily enjoy the sensation mm. of golfing. I like that. Just like in Wii Sports or whatever. On top of all that, there are several modes with new elements that truly uh, bring the heat to Mario Bowser Golf, doing? including this uh, one, Speed Golf. What? Here Why do you want to get golf? Turn. Everyone tees off at the same time, then you'll race through the course to reach your ball. Give okay. it another whack to get it closer to the hole, then keep going. Oh I'll my pace god. Your opponents to come out on top. <sighs> your golfing skills aren't the only things at play. Make use of dashes <laughs> and special shots Star to Mario. beat the competition. Excuse me. Oh, yeah, not did Star we mention Mario. Yeah. story mode? As a me character, okay. you'll start out as a rookie as a and develop character. your golfing skills while interacting with various Mushroom Kingdom characters. Huh. Now they have a story mode. Have they always had one? Then allocate points to different stats, allowing you to develop your character however hmm. you'd like. You can also use your me in versus play. Put your golfing skills to the test when Mario Golf Super Rush swings onto Nintendo Switch June, June 25th. Yeah. Pre-orders begin on Nintendo eShop after this presentation. <laughs> Alright. I like the Mario Sports titles, so we never know. I like it that Mario actually. Golf series adds new mm. gameplay for multiplayer modes, as well as the familiar golf gameplay. Look, like Mario Tennis, Mario Strikers is a golf, as a soccer game. Football. Please look forward anyway. to this yeah. game on Nintendo Switch. Or Mario Baseball. Let's yeah. move on to more Nintendo Switch headlines. Mm. I like Mario Sports titles. Ah, they're Check fun. Out these games Mario Kart, Switch. of course. What's new? Got war? Return to the unforgiving world of Pandora in Tales from the Borderlands. Play as the Hyperion oh. Lackey, Reese. We're putting this on there. Con artist Fiona as you set out to recover oh. a mountain of cash. Right. Set between Borderlands 2 and 3, this, this game. game includes all five episodes I mean, filled I'm with assisted. classic Borderlands humor. Gangsters, bandit lords, and vault hunters are just a handful of the obstacles you'll encounter in this choice-driven narrative adventure. Bring everything on a wild ride when Tales from the Borderlands it. launches on Nintendo Switch, March 24th. Oh. 32 of Capcom's so most beloved it. arcade classics are coming to Nintendo Switch. Rewind gameplay, adjust game speed or difficulty, and well. select from a variety of display called. options to relive that sweet arcade goodness. Get 1943 The Battle of Midway for free, mm. then purchase game packs or the standalone Ghosts and Goblins uh, add-on to build your collection. Uh, Local co-op play is also available. Scratch that two. nostalgic itch when Capcom Arcade Stadium oh. launches later today. Sold arcade games. On switch. Brains. As a zombie, you just can't oh get enough God. of it. In this action game from Aspire, you'll build your what? zombie horde and take revenge on the city by turning oh humans into God. your undead allies. Replenish your bodily arsenal with sputum med, gut grenades, and more during your grisly mission. This, this silly. ain't no match for a dead man. Stubs the zombie and Rebel Without a Pulse eats its way onto Nintendo Switch. Wow, really? Pre orders begin today on Nintendo eShop. What the heck? What? You playing as a zombie? Great. It's Travis Touchdown versus Assassins. Wait, oh, aliens? This is aliens. Aliens have invaded Earth. Hold up, is this even the right game? No anyway, more heroes. After three. annihilating an entire city, uh -huh. the aliens have taken over and now host an intergalactic superhero ranking tournament to decide Earth's fate. Here we go. As the crass beam katana this wielding again. assassin Travis uh -huh. Touchdown, yes. you'll need to fight your way to the top to save the world. Oh, hey, 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 not so fast. 
to enter each boss fight, you'll have to do some odd jobs around town and earn enough to pay off the entry fee. You'll then face off against roller. a slew of unusual opponents. Oh, Most of them aliens it? with some crazy tricks. Uh, Study their tactics oh. carefully to gain the upper hand in combat. With a new and improved oh death glove, you'll have access to a variety of deadly skills that can be customized and upgraded before each match. Oh, yeah. The fate of the world is at stake. So get ready to kick some, uh, whatever Booty? aliens have that you can kick. Not gonna say anyway, booty. it'll all make sense so when No More Heroes 3 lands on oh. Earth. Or, you know, Nintendo Switch, August 27th. Okay, great. I'm never playing a single one of those games, but they seem kind of weird and unusual humor. He heaven? Heaven. Oh, you, you almost said the There's other word to say heaven instead. So below. Why do they need assassins heaven. in heaven? <laughs> to do someone's dirty work. Believe me, this was so bad. But usually it's supposed to be hell, not heaven. What? The underworld. Instead, it's heaven. Up there. Ah. Oh, this game looks pretty fun. Ah. Great. What the it's heck is that little tiny thing? You won't last long if you can't rely on yourself. Ah, okay, wow. This game? Like, what is this? Interesting. God's judgment has nothing to do with it. Oh, very well. Really. Ah, Leon Light. God's judgment. Okay, I would say so. Nothing to do with it. Leon Uncover White. Uncover Heaven's Mysteries in Neon White. Coming yeah. to Nintendo Switch, Winter 2021. All right. The DC Superhero Girls are here to save hey. the day. <laughs> Hi, everyone. My name's Barbara Gordon. Really? Yep. AKA Batgirl. Okay. I'm always inventing new gadgets to fight huh? crime, like my batarangs and backup. This is my Supergirl. Gosh. She's super strong and has heat vision. Mm -hmm. Plus super breath. DC. And let's not DC forget Wonder Woman, an Amazonian warrior who wields the lasso of truth. There's a TV show Along with our this. friends Green Lantern, Bumblebee, and Zatanna, we uh, fight evil supervillains to keep oh our city God. safe. But we're not just about the super life. <laughs> we also have our school lives. <laughs> and trust me, there's never a dull moment at Metropolis Funny. High School. Sometimes it'd be nice to get out of class and do some <laughs> shopping downtown okay. with my besties. <laughs> and maybe take some photos to share on Superstar Post while we're at it. <laughs> hey, hey, I got a comment already. Nice. Oh my and I god. I want to hit up Sweet Justice later. Funny. Uh oh, something really bad is threatening the city. No one could have seen it coming. But oh when god. Justice calls, you can count on us to answer no matter what. Right. We just got to make sure no one figures out our secret identities. Back to her. That woman back to DC Superhero Girls Team Power heroically sourced onto Nintendo Switch June 4th. Right. There's a TV show of that, and now they turn into a game. Ready, I've seen that show a few battle. times. Oh, it's, it's funny. It's just DC Comics with the female superhero characters. That's all it is. I mean, well, yeah. If you've seen it too, you know what I'm getting at. It's like, oh, there's a game of it. And yeah. Planther Zombies is now coming to the Switch. Look at that. Oh my god. This game. What the heck? I remember, ah! I remember playing the first game of this. The very first one. Oh my god. Kick some grass. Really? Oh my god. This is, oh, whoa, what? A potato? This is stupid. Funny. Oh, come on. The player. Stupid. Ah, ooh. Okay. Oh my god, this is so weird. Oh. Ah. Let's like 2021. Battle of the neighborhood. Isn't that like crossplay? Adventure. Anyone can. Okay. What is this? Band together on a quest to uh, face evil okay. and save faces. This Metopia is coming to Nintendo Switch. Oh, what? Cast me characters in various oh, roles that? across the kingdom. 
This is weird. Turn your favorite oh, people into your God. allies. Or even make someone the nefarious Dark Lord. Oh. Makeup has been added as a new feature in this oh, game. God. Glam up your okay. and get them ready for Great. adventure. This is weird. There's also a new wig feature. Funny. Letting you weird. go wild with your me creations and make them even more fabulous. In the mm. world of Metopia, relationships mm. are key. So consider spending some quality time with allies to strengthen bonds. Oh. This can give you an advantage during battle. Oh. Yeah, if your see. relationship sour, though, things might take a turn no for the worse. Oh, 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 oh no! Whoa! You have a horse as an ally? Ooh, that horsey. sounds pretty darn good. Really? Care for it? Seriously? It'll lend a hand wow. or hoof okay. in battle. Ah. Okay. Venture wow. with friends and Just... familiar faces in what the lighthearted rocks of Utopia. Coming to Nintendo ah. Switch May 21st. Pre-orders begin weird. today on Nintendo eShop. Weird view. I'm taking it, Nintendo. What the heck, man? Uh, Super uh, Mario themed uh, items are coming yeah. to your island. Finally, of course. Super Mario Brothers food with stuff. 25th anniversary themed items are coming to the Animal Crossing New mm. Horizons game. Hey, look at that. I'm not the familiar items like the, the Super game. Mushroom and the Question Block can be ordered in game as furniture items. Cool. I like Place that. However, and wherever you'd like. That's cool. I know. You can also you, place two warp pipes. I play Animal Crossing. Of course, I'm doing my channel. Uh, Wario scaring him with that, then re use them to that travel reaction you know to island. Eh, hey, so it's, it's why not try teach. recreating the Mushroom Kingdom? On your own island. <laughs> so, not the reactions they're A using. Free they're just the game old, but yeah. Phone the yep. After downloading it, Super Mario that. Brothers items will be available via Nook Shopping starting March 1st. Oh. See if I can buy Keep all an eye of on the those. Official Animal Crossing Twitter account for the In latest there. information. Okay. Good to know. Thanks for letting me know. I'll be jumping in on March. Just check that out, of course. Life on your island. What? That comes February 25th? If I said in March, How it happens. That? These collaboration items oh. will be released as part of the Super Mario Brothers mm -hmm. 35th anniversary Social event. Social wheels. Please wait a rivals. bit longer for their release. Okay. Speaking right. of which, last week, yeah. We had the global launch for the Super mm -hmm. Mario 3D World plus Bowser's Fury yeah. game. You guys have yet to see we me start playing that, that Mario adventure on my channel. Well. Cause I already had it, but I have yet to start Next, playing it. On we my have another Switch. game to show. I already you. have it. That Bowser game, Bowser Fury. Oh, what now? Who? Are they finally releasing the next Zelda game? I don't know what that's what this is. Yeah, what's wrong with me still have not really played the Breath of the Wild? I'm not kidding, what's wrong with me not playing it yet? Dude, this is what I do, I should be able to now. No, that's not what this is. Cause I'm not sure what this is, that's why I'm wondering. He leaves us no recourse! Okay. Swords. Never. S Frost will answer for its crimes today. Are these the way to mm, Raised earth and burnt corpses. You and no other must decide how we proceed. You are a leader and must be the beacon others look to when the night is darkest. Together with these fields, today uh. you burn. Oh. I promise to do all in my Why? power to see us through this safely. Every last one of us. Please. The violence cradle, or what we call it, triangle strategy. Far, right. far away lies the continent of Norzilia, comprised of three nations and limited deposits of salt and iron. Salt! The constant feuds among the, the nations over these precious resources Sorry. eventually ignited into a great conflict known as the Salt Iron War. No, Though salt the balloons! Though the with an uneasy right. truce, decades ah. later the flames of war threatened to engulf the realm once again. You are all that remain. Caught in a tangled, fiery web of plots and conspiracies, a brave group from Glenbrook fights to save their kingdom from the powers that would orchestrate their downfall. Mm. Okay. Our did you say? Mm. Ah! Ah! 
What was that? Oh, no. In this new tactical RPG, battles take place on terrain with different elevations. Wow. A character's attack range is determined by their location and their equipped weapon. The range can be extended oh. by attacking from higher ground with long-range weapons such as bows and arrows. Thus, oh. your forces can use the terrain and other elements to gain the upper hand. Oh. An enemy oh, outflanked is susceptible not only to your initial games. attack, but also uh. a powerful blow from the ally positioned behind the enemy. Oh. What have we here? Oh. Oh. Charge into an enemy to send them flying into position for a oh. follow-up attack. We oh. Link attacks together by first oh. casting ice magic on oh. the flames to create water terrain. Oh. What then electrify the area with lightning magic. Oh. Okay. Like God. It is of the utmost importance to survey the battlefield before taking action. Mm -hmm. All right. Ah! Mm -hmm. Choices and consequences. Throughout the story, you will be faced with making important decisions in a variety of situations. Mm. Okay. Utility, morality, <laughs> liberty. Collectively, your decisions will establish your conviction, affecting how the story unfolds and who will join your cause. Well, so is the local community. Do we or don't we relinquish Prince Roland to Astrost? Critical decisions uh -oh. that may determine the fates of nations are oh, settled geez. by a vote on the scales of conviction. Scales of violence. Use information you've gathered to sway allies toward your favored cause. Scale violence is everything. The story no. will significantly it's on violence. based on oh, how no. the votes are cast. So they refuse to relinquish him to us. Lies! His hand was forced! <laughs> As more critical decisions are made, you may take you down paths divergent from those of other players. You will see what true might is. Uh, true might is. Triangle Strategy, a Ooh. brand new tactical RPG from Square Enix, will Ooh. launch in 2022. Please be on the lookout for more information uh. in the future. Wow. After Next this presentation, year, huh? a demo version of this game will be available to download Ooh. on Nintendo eShop. And in the future, we'll conduct a survey to gather player feedback. We look forward to hearing your responses on the demo. Baby? I don't need to give it a try. Please baby. look forward I don't know. We'll to see. future updates on this brand new tactical RPG from Square right. Enix. Uh -huh. Okay, let's see a oh. few more Nintendo right. Switch headlines. You got more. How much more do you have left? Calling all hunters. Do you have what it takes? What is this? All hunters. Oh. Star Wars? What? Is it doing the chicken dance? What the heck? Oh, I don't know, that's what it looks like. Colin 2021. Okay. This is a little sneak Star Wars preview Hunters of it. is a competitive free to play online game set between episodes 6 and 7. Clash in this third person shooter coming to Nintendo Switch in 2021. Here. Okay. All right, let's do this. All right, guys. Hmm. Do I look what? at you or the camera? Not what is this? You. Take one. What the heck? We all play for different reasons. Hmm. Corgan love battle. Corgan use many weapons. Ah. bladed war axe, spear of misery, What's the heck? soul devouring crossbow. A princess is supposed to lead her people, not be stuck up in some tower waiting for a hero. My line of work, bullets are oh. constantly was in past you. Flaming longsword, blade of doom. Just once, just once, I'd like to catch one of them bullets. You what? know, with my hands. Oh with my this god. Arm, I'm gonna lead my team to victory. And kick some serious ass. <laughs> wow. Look, it's simple. No. Corgan want new weapon. In Knockout City, I'm what is a this? master. I can catch bullets. What is this? No. Oh my god. Okay. What? Quick dodge ball or something? What the frick is this? What the heck? 
Oh god. It's like a World of Warcraft character. Oh my god. Really? Oh my god. Can't believe we're losing to a bunch of dairy farmers. Okay, team. They may have the battle, but not the war. Uh, uh, hey, can we redesign our characters? Not a team what is this? Uniform. Max, this is a war zone, not a bloody fashion show. <laughs> what is this game? Uh, what? Interview's over. Oh, come on, man, one more game. It's like dodgeball, right? That's what this looks like. Knockout City. That game looked kind of funny. Wow. It's like a bunch of characters from other video games. Like, one of them look like they're... Now. One of them look like they're from, uh... Tight, cause you're all going World to of Warcraft. A little game of fate for me. From the creators of the Danganronpa and Zero Escape series mm -hmm. comes a fight for your life. Literally oh. disoriented and trapped right. in an underwater theme park. The 12 of you, known as the Go-Getters Club, must now survive this game of fate at all costs. Oh. Sorry to scare you all, but the game is canceled. The game is suddenly called off. You escape the theme park and get a glimpse of Japan, but what? everyone's vanished. I'm Set confused. off on a captivating journey across the country that blends side-scrolling action with yeah, suspenseful yeah. narrative. I'm the one behind the whole game of fate. As you make your way back home okay. to Tokyo, you'll alternate between working solo and teaming oh up God. with a group to overcome challenges well. and monsters that stand in your way. What awaits you all at the end of your journey? The battle huh. for survival begins in World's That's End Club, featuring onto Nintendo Switch. May 28th. Mm -hmm. World Zoom Club. Okay. Wield the powers of Olympus hey. in the physical release Hades. of Hades. Yeah, oh. Hades, the critically huh? acclaimed dungeon crawler and recipient of multiple Game of the I'm Year sure awards, yeah. is getting a physical release on Nintendo Switch. I this said at one point a of I was going to try and play these uh, the games that have the, first the award during the Game Awards. The Hades original soundtrack. It's packed Ooh. with two and a half hours of blood pumping music composed by Darren Cole. Yeah, I like music in this game. Known for his game. work on previous Super Giant titles like Transistor and Bastion. Ah, the second yeah, is a 32 page full color character compendium featuring portraits of the game's vibrant cast of gods, mythology. And, ghosts, and monsters, all yeah, by mythology, Super Giant's art director, Gen Z. That's what it is. And let's not forget the game itself, mm -hmm. offering dozens of hours of exhilarating action paired with a compelling story. Mm -hmm. Escape believe. the underworld okay. again or for the first time with the physical Hades. version of Hades on March 19th. Yep. That's my too. Okay. Three deadly action games. I already have it on the Steam though. Collection. Oh, they seriously. No, Ninja no, what Gaiden is Sigma. this? Oh, okay. Ninja I wasn't Sigma sure what this was. And Ninja Gaiden 3 Razor's Edge are coming to Nintendo Ooh. Switch as the action packed Ninja Gaiden Master game? Collection. Ooh. They were bringing those games to Switch. You are the legendary right. ninja Ryu Hayabusa, fighting against those the great hard? with battle skills that are second to none. Like Wield really an arsenal hard. of killer weapons, each offering a playstyle mm. with a different set of lethal skills, along with ruthless uh, ninjutsu to swiftly that. take down enemies. Ninjutsu. Quickly gauge your opponent's movements while unleashing fast and frenzied combos. Oh. And team up with other super ninjas in your quest oh. to fulfill your destiny. Mm. Yeah. Okay. All previous downloadable content, including costumes and game modes, are included. Revel in the intensity of Ninja Gaiden in one dynamic collection. Mm. Ninja Gaiden Master Collection slices its way onto Nintendo Switch Summer 2021. I remember hearing about those games. I a collection of all three games are on the Switch. More battles hey. are coming to Hyrule Warriors. There Age you of go. Calamity. There's, there's Hyrule Warriors again. This again. It takes place before Breath of the Wild. All right. Hyrule Warriors. Yeah. Mm hmm. No. Nah. Hmm? Oh. That's what they're doing there. Controlling that thing. Yeah. Expansion pass. I need to start playing that. Before the expansion pass well, comes out in May. Three orders to get to the Oh, Alright. Cool. 
There's even more Ooh, coming to Nintendo, Nintendo Switch. Nintendo Switch. Or Bravely Bam. Default 2 is almost here. Oh. Four this. heroes of light will soon embark on a journey to restore the crystals. Use the job system oh, to develop your characters God. and master the brave and ah. default commands to emerge victorious in turn-based battles. I live to fight. Veterans Ooh. and newcomers to the series can enjoy this brand new story on February 26th. A new trailer for Bravely mm. Default 2 will be hmm. revealed following this presentation. The game oh. can be pre-ordered on Nintendo eShop. An updated demo is also available. All right. Okay. The latest installment in the legendary Ghosts and Goblins yeah. series comes to life. As the this. brave knight Arthur, you'll unleash weapons, spells, and skills to battle monsters across challenging stages within God, the demon realm. Game. Local co-op play is also available really? for the first time. Help Arthur in his quest with one of three supporting characters. Barry for defense, Carrie for transportation, or Archie for bridges. Ghosts huh. and Goblins Resurrection launches February 25th. Pre-orders so are available now on Nintendo eShop. We're bringing that to the Switch. That hard game. Ridiculously Eight hard. Protagonists. Yeah. Eight captivating journeys. Saga Frontier has been Don't remastered for Nintendo to play Switch. It. Travel through a stunning sci-fi world with any of the protagonists, each with their own stories. With the addition of the playable protagonist Fuse, new gameplay mm -hmm. features, exhilarating battles, and a new scenario for the protagonist, Acellus. Saga oh, Frontier Remastered eh? is an adventure not to be missed. The game eh? launches April 15th. Uh -huh. Apex Legends is storming onto the Nintendo Switch system. This free-to-play battle royale features hey. a growing roster of powerful contenders named Legends, strategic combat, cross-platform play, and more. All players Plus. on Nintendo Switch can get an all-new legendary Pathfinder skin, and oh. 30 free levels for the Season 8 Mayhem Mouse Battle on the Pass. Switch. Plus, for the first two weeks after launch, earn double XP when you play on Nintendo Switch. Uh -huh. Fight for fortune, fame, and glory when Apex Legends enters the fray March 9th. My God. Huh? How's it going so far? Yeah. Mm -hmm. There's still a little bit more to show you in today's Nintendo Direct, so we How hope you'll stick with us. How much Next, more do you got, please dude? Please take a look at this. Okay, let's see it. What's it got? You're gonna send Smash Bros. earlier. Hello there, I'm Eiji Aonuma, producer of the Legend of Zelda series. Okay, hello. I'm sure a lot of you saw me and thought there might be news about the sequel to the Legend of Zelda Breath of the Wild game. Okay, yeah, Unfortunately, right. we don't have anything to share right now. Oh, all right. We apologize. Hmm. Development is proceeding okay. smoothly, and we should be able to bring you some new information this year. All right. For now, we'll have to ask you to wait just a bit longer. Mm-hmm, okay. Finally. While you're all waiting, however, this Legend of Zelda game will be coming to Nintendo Switch. Of course. Please take a look. All right. Oh, we have another one. I see. Wait, you've been making another one while working on the Hyrule? Ah! Okay. The remastered version. A definite version. Great. Of this game. I've never played this. On the Wii. Or is it Wii U? Yeah, this game. Did I play this on the Wii or Wii U? I can't remember. Before the Switch. Now they're bringing it to the Switch. This game? Yeah. Yeah. Skyward Sword. Yes. Right. It's the... Like a remastered version. What you've just seen is the Legend of Zelda Skyward Sword HD. Mm-hmm. This game originally released in 2011 on the Wii console, and now yeah, it's coming right. to Nintendo Wii. Switch. Or, not Wii, Wii. The Legend of Zelda Skyward Sword mm -hmm. featured a control scheme in which players would use the Wii Remote Plus controller as a sword and the mm -hmm. Nunchuck controller as a shield. With the increased processing power yeah. of the Nintendo Switch system, the controls here wow. are smoother and even more intuitive. <laughs> and we've recreated the controls for the sword and the shield here by having the player hold two Joy-Con controllers. Uh, yeah. The Joy-Con controller in your right hand is the sword. He'll do it. Swing it to have yeah. Link swing his sword in the game. Maybe I will get on Switch, the but I've already had to leave. The hand is the shield. Never By know. the controller, you can raise the shield ah. to block enemy attacks. Yeah. This you is fun on the Wii. You like using both controllers to wield a bow and arrow. These physical movements add a sense of urgency and tension Can't to combat. Can't say I remember it though. But we also loop. made it possible to play the game with button controls to ensure it can be played in handheld mode or on the Nintendo Switch Lite system. 
After ah. mulling over how to assign different gameplay elements to different buttons, we decided to apply the sword motions to tilting the right control First. stick. You don't want to use the motion controls, that's... Tilt the nice. stick down when you want to swing the sword downward. You want to do that. Horse. To swing to the right, to the yeah. left, or right. diagonally, right. just tilt the stick in the respective direction. Of course. Because we're not using motion controls. Here's something else we've been working on. Oh? Specially designed Joy-Con controllers. Ooh, that's nice. The right Joy-Con controller is themed after the Master Sword, while the uh, left features a Hylian shield motif. Oh. Uh, Okay. The Legend of Zelda Skyward Sword, Ocarina as the game depicting the earliest story in the Legend of Zelda timeline, details mm -hmm. the events around the creation of the Master Sword itself. All right, I'm Ocarina of Time. We hope that people there too, who played the original game right. on Wii, and those playing Play it for the first old. time, will enjoy oh. discovering the origins of the Legend of Zelda. Mm -hmm. This is like the first game in the series. So the Legend of Zelda Skyward Sword remember, HD they launches said July here. 16th. This. That's in Following July 16th. this Nintendo Direct, you'll right. be able to pre-order the game on Nintendo eShop. Uh -huh. And the specially designed Joy-Con controllers will launch on the game's release date at your local retailers. Mm -hmm. Many of you may already know this, but The Legend of Zelda Skyward Sword was the last original console game prior to The Legend of Zelda Breath of the Wild game, and it was oh. still following the established conventions of The Legend of Zelda. However, it gave a glimpse oh. into many features and innovations that would eventually be adopted in The Legend of Zelda Breath of the Wild. Using right. the sailcloth to descend in midair, uh -huh. A stamina gauge that depleted as you scaled walls with mm. vines or ran. Mm -hmm. Even the concept of collecting items to upgrade gear. Oh. I hope those of you who've played The right. Legend of Zelda Breath of the Wild will give this game a try as well. I don't know if I'll play it again. Who knows? Maybe, maybe not. I've had on the wheel already. Please look forward Took to The Legend of again. Zelda Skyward Sword HD. Yeah, it's like for those who never owned a Wii U or... We probably well, going on the Switch. What did you think? I the Legend know. of Zelda Skyward Sword these, has these been optimized reports. for Nintendo Switch. Porting the game over to the newer console from the previous console. By tilting the right control stick. Please. Okay, the yeah. next game will be our last announcement for today. Okay. Please take a look at this. You showed a lot, man. Jeez. Or Smash Bros. at the beginning. What now? What is this? Ooh? It looks like Warlands. No, it's not. What is this? No way! What? Seriously? You literally... Hey! You literally stayed on it. No way. It's Splatoon 3, isn't it? Hey! What the heck, man? Yep. You customize your character. That's Splatoon 3. Why did it look a little bit like Thornlands? Oh my god. <laughs> hey, it's Splatoon 3. Nice. We're finally seeing that. Ah, after Splatoon 2. Ah, look at that. Is it Splatoon 3? I could just still be Splatoon 2. A train. Yeah, it looks like it looks like a Borderlands kind of thing. Splatoon the Borderlands or something. The vibe I'm getting from the environment. Environment. Okay, what was that? Mm-hmm. Ah. You're on the train. Is it like another story mode for Splatoon? Two? Or Splatoon 3, I don't know. Probably for, still for Splatoon 2. They got more content for Splatoon 2. Looks like it. Yeah, it does. And this is Splatoon 3, maybe? Is this Splatoon 3? I don't know. Looks like it could be. My music. Oh, 
Look at my favorite one. Okay, hey, hey, it's the apocalypse because uh, Team Chaos won. You see what it looks? It looks like the apocalypse or something like Borderlands kind of thing. That's what I'm thinking there, since you know, Team Order, Team Chaos, Team Chaos won the final splat the latest installment That's in what the I'm seeing there. Series, Splatoon 3. This game is scheduled That's what it looks like to me. Splatoon 3. So it'll be a while. Oh. We hope you'll stay tuned for more information next year. Okay. All right. Next year. Not on the Switch. Is it on Today, the Switch? We showed you a sampling of games coming to Nintendo Switch. Sweet. That's cool. A variety of games are wow. in development. Great. And we look forward to sharing more news with you in the future. <laughs> well, we can be happy for seeing that. Thank you for watching. You're welcome. Thank you for sharing. Wow. All right. There's a lot of games there. Save the best. Save the great. Something really good there for last. So, yep, that was a new react. That was me doing this reaction video to Nintendo Direct, February 17th, 2021. So thank you for watching. You're welcome. Thank you for sharing. Wow. Yeah. I, when I saw that at the very beginning, the Smash Bros. New, new fighter for Smash Brothers Ultimate, I'm like, what is this? Another. I wasn't quite sure what the game was. I'm like, yeah, it's like Xenoblade Chronicles 2. And. They're bringing, they're bringing another Xenoblade Chronicle character from the, uh, you know, Xenoblade Chronicles 2 in the Smash Bros. Like, they already brought Shulk from the first Xenoblade Chronicles. Right. Yeah, when I saw that thing, I was a little confused. I'm like, what is this? And I was like, what? Oh, it's the Smash Bros. I wasn't entirely sure what it was. Actually. But, yeah, I was like, what the heck? I got a little confused when I saw that at the beginning and then they show yeah Splatoon 3 at the end yeah I'm sure Lincoln is really excited to see that <laughs> Lincoln is another person that has another uh um, I guess you could say he's a content creator is he no uh, sorry the um, point is is another person that I that I happen to well no of course you know you see me play with and Danny Star Line 2 if you ever see me uh do videos on that game on that channel yeah he plays that game uh well i play and he plays along with me in that game and he plays a lot of splatoon yeah lincoln yeah. if you know who i'm talking to if you see me play uh famous star line 2 those videos on like uh videos over famous star line 2 that content on my channel and you know who lincoln is he likes a lot of splatoon yeah, Splatoon, Splatoon 2. Now they release the Splatoon 3. So that doesn't come out till 2022. Of course. Right. 2022. Wow. They threw so many games at us. I can't even remember every game they threw at us. Nope. So yeah, that was an Nintendo Direct for February 17th, 2021. And it was live. You can see down here. It was live. I was watching this live. Well, it wasn't streaming. Just watching it live and recording it. So, yeah, wow, cool. Hmm. Let me go here. There we go. Back to full screen now. So, yeah, so many games thrown at us there. Just couldn't even like, what's the word I'm looking for? Couldn't like, yeah. Man, I can't remember. I can't even remember every game they threw at us there. Just. Wow, there's a lot of games. Yeah, it has been a while since I did into a track like that. Yeah, the way I started the video. <laughs> it's like, you know, hey everybody, and it's all Sonic and welcome to a new Nintendo Direct or reaction video over Nintendo Direct. She was just starting, just as I was beginning, basically. So I just jumped right into it there. Yeah. Mm-hmm. So alright. Cool. That was great. It's nice to find this in their Nintendo Direct since so it's been a while. They haven't really done one like that in a long time. So it's nice that they did one. Yeah. Still some of the games I need to actually go and play before some of these sequels come out. You know, the games I already have, like Hyrule Warriors, for example. Or uh, Bowser Fury and Super Mario 3D World. I don't know if I'll get that other Zelda game. 
called a God, I forgot what it's called. Skyward Sword, yeah. I played that in the week. Should I really bother buying it again on the Switch? All these ports, they keep porting old games onto their. They keep. Pre yeah, they just keep porting all the Wii U titles. Uh, a lot of the Wii U titles. And I guess the Wii U. <laughs> Some on the Switch. They keep doing that. And I'm like, I'm not too sure if I should re buy this game. Since I owned it on the previous console, the, the Wii U. I sent, yeah, there's a lot of games that they re-released on the Switch. Because assuming a lot of people didn't own a, a Wii U, that's probably what course one reason why they do that. And it's like, shouldn't bother. But I wasn't sure if I was going to get Super Mario 3D World until they did the whole Bowser Fury thing. And then I then I actually got it. But yeah. It's, yeah, it's one of those things where you're not sure you want to re-buy the game they already have the Wii U. Like, I could just go back and play it. Like, oh, they put Funky Kong. You know, like, Funky Kong in uh, that Tropical Freeze Donkey Kong Country game. Funky Kong Country Tropical Freeze, right? On the Wii U. They brought that to the Switch. I didn't bother re-buying it. I could re-buy it, but the point. Like, the, oh, the... Was it New Super Mario Brothers U? New Super Mario Brothers U. Is that what it's called? That was originally on the Wii U, and then they re-released it. It was a deluxe version. They re-released it on the Switch. You know what I'm talking about? Yeah. I feel like I said the name wrong, but... Yeah. A lot of games they threw at us there. Like, I gotta... I still gotta try and... You know, since they released Splatoon 3, I feel like... Yeah, I'll be honest. There's... Yeah, I don't know why, but I'm surprised I still haven't even beaten the story mode where in the first Splatoon and even in the second Splatoon. So I feel like I gotta go try and beat the story mode in Splatoon and in Splatoon 2 before Splatoon 3 comes out. I still need to try and beat Breath of the Wild before the sequel to Breath of the Wild comes out. I'm like, so you bother Vine Scar Skyward? Ugh, Sky. Word sword. I feel like I'm messing up on the title of that Legend of Zelda game that they just re released. They're re releasing it on Switch from the, the Wii. Like, I played that on the Wii. It was great. Fun. I get to play it again on the Wii. I also think of that if I'm even going to bother rebuying it again. I mean, it could, but I already own it, you know, on a previous console. It's just, I don't know. We'll see. When they do things like that, like, yeah, a lot of titles that were on the Wii U have been re-released on the Switch. Like, they had a... Did they have, like, a Hyrule Warriors already? They had a, the first Hyrule Warriors, and they had a definitive edition of it. And then they had Hyrule Warriors Calamity, which is... Yeah, it's, it's like another Hyrule... They had, like, three Hyrule Warriors games. Well, there's just one, and they had a definitive version on the Switch while the original one was on the Wii U. And then they had a Calamity, right, which takes place, is those called Calamity? I forget, God, I forget what some of the titles are, what they're called. Yeah, like I said, they just threw a lot of games up there. I don't really remember any of them. Mario, Mario Golf. Yeah, I like playing a lot of Mario Sports titles. I like playing those. So, and I'll probably get that, yeah. I don't know, you guys haven't really seen me play Mario Tennis Ace on my channel yet. You haven't, but maybe I'll play that sometime on my channel. It's just, well, I know there's a lot of Nintendo games I play that I own. I literally own, but I haven't really been playing much of or creating content with on my channel due to, you know, my niche. But ever since I changed up how I create my content over my niche on seasonal events, and sets. Ever since that, I changed up how I execute on creating that content, I should have more time to create content over Smash Bros. Over Smash Bros. Yeah, thank you. Because I've been lying to since I mentioned my second vlog. That's really old. There's a lot of things I want to do that I couldn't get around to do because I created a, a ridiculously hard niche for myself. It doesn't quite allow me to build this schedule edit and schedule my videos i should be able to do that but yeah i set things up to where i couldn't really do that and i wasn't really didn't know what to expect 
but yeah, things have changed and I should be able to this year. Like I remember saying since last year in my one of our previous vlogs. Vlogs of it. God, I feel like I can't really talk right now. My mouth is getting dry. But yeah. Anyway, it's fun reacting to that Nintendo Direct February 17th, 2021 uh, video. Yeah, of course, we bring another Xenoblade Chronicles uh, character. Let's run Xenoblade Chronicles 2 in Smash Bros. I was confused. I didn't, I don't know. I didn't, I feel like there was just low, like to the point where I didn't have much of a reaction at all when I saw that. I was just, what? Okay. I was confused when I saw that. I was like, who? Wait, oh, right. I wasn't sure what the game was that the character was crossing over from in the Smash Bros. Yeah. Never played any of the Xenoblade Chronicle games. You know, there's a sequel. I'm aware of that. Yeah, well, we saw it there. Again, a character from it came to Smash Bros. And now, oh, Shulk's not the only one. Yeah, they're bringing, like, characters from games that... They've already released the. They've already. They're bringing characters from a series of games that they've already released a character to in the first place. Like, Cloud has already been on. Cloud from Final Fantasy has already been on Smash Bros. And then they bring, uh, you know. Yeah. They bring Sephiroth. Yeah. You know, see what they're doing here? Yeah. They're bringing, like, characters from a series that they've already brought ca a, a character from. I'm still wondering, are they still going to bring, like, uh, Shadow the Hedgehog by any chance in the Smash Bros? Since they have Sonic, Sonic the Hedgehog, you see what I'm getting at here? Who knows, maybe, maybe not. Or, I don't know if Crash Bandicoot is ever going to get in. <laughs> maybe not, you never know. Or other characters that have been one of them. We'll have to wait and see, because they're almost done with this Fighter Pass, the second volume of Fighter Pass. Yeah, we went on doing videos over the DLC fighters in the classic mode in Smash Bros. Yeah, I had some videos that, well, as of me talking to this, this reaction video about it, and yet to have all those uploaded as of me talking about it in this reaction video, but regardless of whether you've seen this, chances are they're probably already uploaded in the future, but yeah. Yeah, I did a playthroughs like do classic mode as every DLC fighter in Smash Bros. But I get to have all those videos uploaded when I can. So, yeah, why well, I'm mentioning that in this video. Yeah, it's like, I'm just, I'm just talking here about my thoughts on some of these games here. So, I don't know if I'll, who knows? I'll probably maybe buy some, some of them, but maybe not all. Like the Monster Hunt, like the new Monster Hunter one. God, I'm literally having a hard time talking right now. Sorry if it doesn't sound like I'm speaking clearly, but yeah, all right. That's it for this reaction video. It's cool. I just wanted to say some things about it after, you know, reacting to it. it seemed like an okay, decent yeah. Nintendo Direct after not seeing one like this for a while. Yeah, Splatoon 3, New Fighter and Smash Bros. A couple sequels and uh, new games coming out, of course, soon. Some are even in 2022. Right, that's three. Yeah. All right. Cool. So, yeah, that's it for this video. So, okay, that's it for this reaction video. So, all right. Yeah. So yeah, that's it for this video. So, let me know what you guys thought about this video. In the let us know what you guys thought about this reaction video in the comments down below yeah or if you like this video you can take a this and smash on that like button <laughs> or i can just slap it you know oh yeah, just slap that naughty like that oh it's such a naughty like that just slap that like that oh yeah <laughs> <laughs> just, 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 it's like one. If you like the video, really, that's not big deal. It's all up to you. You really do like this deal, but I don't know. I feel like I didn't have much of a reaction. 
I'm not kidding. I don't know why, but... Eh. Yeah, and to be honest, I literally kind of woke up before the direct was, was starting. I was trying to hurry as much as possible to try to get to it before I was going to miss any of it. So, you probably noticed just as I started the video. Probably. Yeah, and I was like, what? Let's snatch those characters. So, yeah. Mm. Or, if you'd like to see more from me, mm. or any of my other videos, then you could subscribe. Really, I do, I do, re I do a lot of reaction videos like this, or I kind of just do them off the side up for fun, aside from my main focus over seasonal events and games, where I check out, where I check out in-game events, such as seasonal events, they're time, time-limited event, like, they're t there's these time-limited, time-limited events in video games, you know, seasonal events like Christmas, Halloween, those are the most common ones. That happen every year, once every year, you know. I basically go in summary overview of the event, and then after going overview and doing an overview in summary of the events on one video, as many in one video called my overviews video, my like said like name a seasonal event like overviews uh video. I check out these games in summary overview like of what's new like you know what the new skins or time to game mode and stuff like that because it's fun to do that and then after doing that chances are i may go in game in depth of further detail on everything i just checked out in in summary overview overview of the event I feel like i'm not speaking clearly sorry so you can like to do a bit of that that's what i mainly do on my channel aside from reaction aside from reaction videos off to the side i also do what i like to call seasonal reaction videos where i react to uh seasonal event as part of just going in in an overviewed summary of the of the you know event hence i react to a video that's a, a summarized showcase of the event yeah i do that and then i'll like analyze the video because of the event and just the video yeah just another little thing i do but yeah if you're interested to see any of that stuff i just kind of explain to you what i do on this channel talk about reaction videos or sometimes they do like playthroughs walkthroughs and stuff like that i guess the in-game in-depth is sort of like a playthrough i be playing through the game to check out the in-game event the seasonal event like Check out this Christmas event or Halloween event in this video game. Or how many games can I find have a Halloween event in it? And see what they do for their Halloween event in that game. You know? That's sort of like what I like to do. It's fun. So if you're new to my channel, you know, see me doing any of that stuff here yet. And you'd like to see a bit of that or more reaction videos, then you can subscribe. You can subscribe. It's all up to you. Yeah. So, yeah. It's all up to you. <laughs> So yeah, <laughs> yep, and with that said, thanks for watching everybody, see you next time.